The woman is behind bars tonight, charged in the death of a two-year-old girl found inside a car on Friday night. Thanks for choosing 23 ABC News at 11. I'm Amanda Gomez. 23 ABC's Leslie Marine is in studio with where police now stand in their investigation. Thanks, Amanda. Neighbors say police found the car with the unresponsive toddler inside of it. And now a 20-year-old woman could be to blame. We just saw it. We didn't think anything of it. And then... We came out 10 minutes later and the cops are already here. Many people on the 3300 block of Chester Lane are still wondering how their street became the center of a crime scene. She, that person was just right there, like we didn't think anything of it. And then we left and we came back and they were still there outside. So that's when we're like, well, who are these people? And then we just came back inside and that's when we see all the sirens. Just after 11 Friday night, Bakersfield police were sent out to this neighborhood to check on a child. That's when they found a two-year-old girl not breathing inside a car. Um, seeing it taped off, I seen two vehicles. I seen one of the cars um, had the doors open. Um, they were looking inside the car. Um, evidently, it was a body back there, um, a little girl, and um, it was just it was just a sad scene. Police say the toddler suffered trauma to her lower extremities. 20-year-old Wendy Guadalupe Gomez has been arrested for felony willful harm to a child causing injury or death. Police have not released information on why or how the child died. That's just sad, you know, especially a two-year-old, you know. I have a two-year-old, so it's sad to see that. Police have not said if Gomez was in fact the mother of the child, but she's scheduled to be in court on Tuesday. For 23ABC, I'm Leslie Marine.